had, say, a poem. Hey, it's okay, I don't mind. Myself. And now I'm overhearing your all stuff with me. But the basic what the tutors would have done is October 31st was the time when the two worlds, the spirit and the human, were closest together. So actually on this eve, we would just bar our doors, bar our windows, and keep it shut. We wouldn't go outside. Normally we don't, but especially not tonight. November 1st was All Saints Day. It was the day that you would remember all the saints who had passed on and gone to heaven. So you've just had a day complete of fear where bad things could have gone wrong. And your next day, so tomorrow, will be, it'll be a nicer day. It's more of a religious festival. And you'll be remembering the saints. Saints Peter, Paul, all of them. I'm sure there's more. And then on November the 2nd was All Souls Day. And that was where you would go around from house to house, just like the idea of trick-or-treating, but you would knock and you would ask for a soul cake. And the idea was you were asking for that soul cake, and you would say a prayer, and they'd give you the soul cake. And the prayer would be for someone you've lost, possibly. In this period, hygiene's not very good. The simplest thing, like a cut or a burn, could turn septic and it could kill you. Infant mortality rate was the highest it's almost ever been in this country, and most people didn't survive past the age of five. So, of course, everyone would have known someone at the time who was dying or died. So, of course, it was a very important thing for us, because you had these people you wanted to remember. And they believed that when you died, you didn't go straight to heaven or hell. You were stuck in something called purgatory, or limbo, you may have heard. And basically, you just, you'd kind of be stuck there for however long it really took. But if you had your family members or friends who were praying for you, or every year would go and get a soul cake for you, it took you one step closer to either, if you were a good religious tutor, being sent up to heaven to be with God. Or if you were of the other persuasion, being sent somewhere else. We 